Hi everyone, this is Andrea from Law Career Development here to present you with a few networking tips to help you get the most out of a networking event that you might be attending. Tip number one is prepare beforehand. If you're attending a tabling event where you know there will be lots of different legal employers, ask the sponsors of the event for a list of who is going to appear there. Then do your research online. Google the firm, look up their website, read about the different practice areas that they engage in. Then take a look at the attorney bios. This will help you come up with a short list of conversation topics to touch on when you meet these people during the event. While you're in conversation with them, focus on the subjects that you have in common to maintain the flow of discussion. If you're having trouble coming up with conversation topics, ask questions. Attorneys love to talk. They love to talk about their work, their personal experiences, their interests, vacations that they've been on, family, kids, etc. Get them talking about any of these topics and make sure that you maintain eye contact, smile, nod, and ask more follow-up questions to keep the person engaged. Second, make sure that you dress appropriately for the event that you're attending. If you're unsure, you can ask the event host what the recommended dress attire should be. For example, if you're going to a tabling, MCLE, social, or other general event, dress in business casual. However, if you're attending something more formal, such as an award ceremony or a dinner banquet, business formal, such as a suit and tie, is appropriate. Please do not wear jeans to the networking event. Next, don't be overwhelmed with the number of people that might be attending the event. Set small goals. For example, when you're attending an event, establish a goal of having a substantive conversation with three new people. This will help make the event seem more manageable. Additionally, if you're feeling apprehensive about attending something, bring a friend. Split up once you arrive, then check in periodically with each other to discuss your experiences. Importantly, do not spend the entire time speaking with each other. Instead, use this as an event as an opportunity to meet new people. If you're attending a dinner reception, instead of going directly to your seat at the table, stand up, introduce yourself to every person at the table, and engage in conversation with them before you're seated for dinner. Next, be ready to introduce yourself in a way that communicates your professional interests. We call this the elevator speech, and it should be a short blurb about who you are and what you're interested in as a way of introducing yourself to new people. If you need help, consider using this formula. My name is Andrea. I'm a second year law student at Golden Gate University focused on working with individual indigent clients on employment discrimination issues in the workplace. You can adapt this formula to suit your goals. Next, spend time talking with people even if you don't think that their practice areas or professional interests are aligned with what you might be interested in. In addition to learning something interesting and new, you might discover that you have an interest in their field of practice, or you might discover that they have contacts in the legal community who engage in the practice area that you're interested in. When you're meeting with different people, remember to collect their business cards before you conclude the conversation. Step away every once in a while and jot down on the back of their business card one to two things that you talked about. After the event, make sure and follow up with either an email or a handwritten note card. In your thank you card, you can discuss topics that you talked about during the event, which you've now written down on the back of their business cards. If you're interested in continuing a relationship with this person, suggest getting together for an informational interview over coffee or lunch, or connect with them over LinkedIn. If you reach out to them and you don't hear anything back after a week, follow up again. Oftentimes, attorneys are very busy and emails get lost in their inbox. It's not because they don't want to speak with you. Lastly, make sure you be yourself and have fun. Relax and enjoy the fact that this is networking and socializing. It's not meant to be a painful process. Enjoy!